Okay, so I put on the new motor controller right there. Uh, wired it all up. I see a bunch of wires going all around. I moved the battery box uh, down underneath it now. I added some more rubber bands just to hold it on. Um, and, oh yeah, added a couple wires right there. So, uh, that's for the control. Now, what I learned was when you hook up the wires to these motor controllers, don't hook them up wrong because this motor controller, and I'm sure you'll never see it, but um, yeah, I set the power wire right on the one pin in and the ground wire on the pin on the inside of that, so just one pin over. Burned out the motor controller. That's another $29 wasted. Anyways, um, we're in demo mode, so I can plug it in, maybe, maybe, there we go. So demo mode turns it, drives it back and forward. And you can see from this that the, that this test compared to the other test was, is a lot better. It's not using as much power, and it also seems to be going for a little bit faster, a little bit better, more stable. So, that's it. I'll get the programming done.